Hey you guys, what's up, my name is Trix, aka Nico, and welcome back to another video. We're back at it again with skills. Now more than ever, skill is something everyone's got through their mind, as even the admins seem to want to push you into that direction with all the recent updates. Just like with every other video, feel free to subscribe and like the video if you enjoy it. It's free and you can always change your mind later on, and it helps me out a ton. Today we got yet another content creator by our side to help us understand what grinding a skill to level 50 actually means. 30 virus, who probably doesn't even need an introduction, is joining us today, so if you want to hear him out on an exclusive interview, then make sure to stick around till the end. The farming skill, just like every other skill, comes with coins, a tiny stat boost, in this case health points, and a chance for multiple drops, on crops this time. So let's talk about preparation. Pet wise, you're left with two choices. You have to choose between either the very expensive but returning elephant pet, or the rabbit pet, which is way cheaper and also gives you even more XP, but won't give you the option to use farming as a money making method, as there is no ability that grants you even more drops. The rabbit pet can also be used in its epic version, as the legendary ability only helps you with minions. This though is a very useful effect and if you want to use your minions as well, this is a must have. It sits around 90,000 coins and 500,000 coins for these rarities and therefore is a very affordable and worthy pet. The elephant pet on the other hand is very different. Not only will you need the legendary rarity to even get the farming boost, in this case a hard drop chance on crops and also does it sit around 17 million coins as it is a pet only obtainable from the traveling zoo. It's a very different style to go for as it only generates a lot more coins but you'll have to choose by yourself which we'll talk about later on as well when we talk about how to actually farm. Effects. Just like with every other skill video, I highly recommend the god potion as it contains every positive effect you would want to wish for. But if you want to be specific, the only really needed potions would be the farming XP boost as well as speed potions that will make it way easier running through your farms. Other than that, the cookie buff grants you 20% more XP for every single skill. That's basically a must have as well. The most important equipment will be the tool you'll be using to farm a certain crop. This could mean the new Turing sugar cane or the new pumpkin dicer or any other tool that you can obtain from Anita using gold medals. Obviously, if you're just starting out, a simple Rukiho or a normal golden axe will just do fine as well. The best enchantments would be efficiency for axes, harvest for hoes, and if it's a crop that needs to be replanted, the replenish enchantment will do that for you. For reforges, I would highly recommend the blessed fruit, which applies the blessed reforge and not only gives you an XP boost, but a higher chance for multiple item drops. Lastly, events. Events have become a major factor in playing this game, as it not only acts as a way to spice up things here and there, but they're also very good if you're looking to grind not only for money, but also XP in a certain skill. Jacob's farming contests are new ways of gaining not only XP whilst competing with others, but it also allows you to increase your farming level cap to level 60 which is the first skill to ever surpass level 50. These events don't really enhance your XP gain, but as they give you another option to gain money and add rewards to the farming skill, this is definitely something you could use to your advantage. So now that you're prepared, let's talk about how to farm the farming skill. Sugarcane or Pumpkin this is probably nothing new to the most of you, as pumpkins and sugarcane are the most used crops to achieve a high farming level. Pumpkins give the most XP, and if you're looking towards getting the highest farming skill, it would probably be the best choice to set up a pumpkin farm, and just simply grind away with your rabbit pet. Sugarcane on the other hand though, especially with the new Turing hoe, is able to compete with pumpkin quite well. A test with a maxed out Turing hoe and a rabbit pet turned out to only produce 400 XP less per minute farming sugarcane in comparison to pumpkins. The money output on the other hand is significant as sugarcane not only rewards you with even more money but the ability to gain insane amounts of sugarcane out of one single drop. This makes it, at least in my opinion, an even better chance than pumpkin. Like I said, if you're talking about skill XP only, pumpkins are still better, but the money you'd be missing out on is definitely a major factor and it makes it totally worth grinding away on using sugarcane even if it'll take you a bit longer to reach the maximum level. The next method is going to be Jacob's events. Another way to farm the farming skill is simply using the newly introduced Jacob events. If you build enough farms to participate in most of these contests, even if the XP you gain from potatoes for example are significantly less, this is still a quite reasonable way to get not only XP but also make a ton of money on the side. And as you're only bound to farm for 20 minutes each, this is a great way to gain XP and still maintain a changing style in gameplay. Last but not least, minions. Just like with a lot of other skills, minions are very very productive when it comes to granting you farming XP. The best setup in this case would be farming minions such as the melon minion equipped with a diamond spreading in range of a farming crystal and then fuel them with hyper catalysts. 
To get this method work out even better, it is highly recommended to AFK on your island with the highest level legendary rabbit pet that you are able to afford, as otherwise this method will result in an insane money loss. As this is probably a very expensive setup though, this is not for everyone. But if you can afford it and you are able to AFK 24-7, you could actually end up going even or even profiting from all the money you would have to spend on the hyper catalysts. But for everyone else, the melon minions even without the hyper catalysts are a very good choice to generate farming XP. So now that we talked about how to prepare and how to actually grind towards the maximum level for the farming skill, here's an interview with 30 virus talking about grinding towards level 50 in farming even before all those new updates that made it far easier to progress in this skill. Well then <laughs> welcome and thank you so much for joining us today talking about farming. Um, oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've been talking to, to a lot of other creators about various different skills but I was it was highly requested and it was a big big deal getting you on for farming especially I'm, I'm, I'm guessing especially because of all the pumpkin farming you did yeah I did most of my farming before most of the things that made it easier came out yeah so <laughs> I, I, yeah that's that's yeah. what I said in the video earlier as well it's 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 really funny because now that farming and skills are so much easier so if I put yeah. the same amount of effort in just six months later I'd probably have like at least four times the amount of pumpkins XP yeah 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 totally coins. and you would have gold medals money yeah it's it's kind of stupid. Oh, yeah. Okay, um, when did you reach uh, farming level fifty? That is a like good a roundabout. Question. I could probably look it up actually. Maybe by <laughs> farming mean, fifty. Just a roundabout. I mean, if I didn't make a if I didn't make a title for that, I mean that's just wasted clickbait. Yeah. Okay. Fair yeah. Enough. So that video came out on January, February, March, April, May, June, July thirteenth. Fair enough. And, 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 and how long do you think you spend like actually farming towards level 50? Because I think, yeah, for, like everyone's farming, you know, but... Uh, I remember for like seven months, all I would do is I would go to work for eight hours, come home, and then farm pumpkins for like three hours, <laughs> and then stream. <laughs> Sometimes uh, there would be work from home days because of weather, and I would spend... I would say at my peak, it was five hours a day farming pumpkins. <laughs> okay, and, and did you do everything? Like, yeah, that's a good question, actually. Did you do ex everything without minions, or did you have minions set up as well? Oh, not a single minion was placed to get oh. any sort of farming Holy XP. <laughs> God, what the hell? How did you get through that? Like, what the hell? I I, like... I, I watched a lot of movies. I would... It's kind of like when you're... Uh, one thing... You know, farming is very uh, easy on the brain. You yeah. don't have to focus. Yeah. So it's kind of like when you're in the shower and you have like the ability to just Thrift think off. and yeah. come up with ideas. So like I would take advantage of that and I would use the text to speech on my phone to just any thoughts that came to my head for ideas for Actually, videos or goals in the series, I would just speak it to my phone. As no I was way you did for that. Hours and hours. <laughs> That sounds so cool, like talking to Jarvis, write it down. It's a great idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, like I really got cool. this I got this crazy Google document that's like well I've got <laughs> it's a network of Google documents. I would say between everything it's over a hundred pages of just ideas and plans and to do lists and all of, a lot cow. of that came from that time. And and what would you say was the most difficult part about it? about farming yeah like you like about the uh, grind itself like did you ever get bored did you ever get like oh my god i want to stop <laughs> uh at the time the channel was picking up a lot of momentum and the way i saw it is the more pumpkins i farmed the better off my channel would be Fair so enough. i mean i powered through it i saw it as an opportunity but i guess the worst thing was just the raw amount of hours that i put yeah. into it like i can see that yeah it was hundreds of hours <laughs> Wait, do you and 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 if you if you do it again nowadays, like for example, would you would you like wait for specific like events to go up? Like, would you do it with like the Jacobs tickets, or would you like how would you do it if you'd have to restart nowadays? Because there's so much more, and it's probably so much less time to spend actually grinding and oh with yeah minions and whatnot. If I were to start my journey again, yeah. Uh, <laughs> just the ideas like Ugh. but if i had to start it again it would definitely uh sync up with the events okay 
I would do a lot more of it on stream. Mm -hmm. um, I'd probably have like three layers of cane. Uh, nowadays, I used to have four layers of pumpkin so I could do it constantly uh, with yeah. no water. But nowadays, I'd probably, I wouldn't go all in on one crop. It would be, uh, Fair, yeah. you know, Jacob's two, la tickets, two yeah. layers of cane, two layers of pumpkin, two layers of melon. Uh, I, mean, I think I can get away with one layer of everything else. Have you heard the, like the, the the upgrade? Like I bought the island upgrade for my co-op because whenever like I had a couple yep. of people join <laughs> and it's insane. Like two point two. Like we have one sugarcane farm and one layer is almost enough to to perma farm it. Like of sugarcane at least. It's insane. Oh wow. I might take advantage of that because <laughs> on my solo profile, I've got this awkward single sugarcane layer just in, in the middle of everything. And I, mean, I, yeah. I want more farm without making everything. Okay, I might do that. Actually. If you, if you don't, if you don't actually want to like, pumpkin is like a teeny tiny bit, like we tested it, like per minute you get like around 400 XP more, but like the money, obviously like, like it all tends towards sugarcane. And I guess, yeah, if you have max island oh, size, yeah. it makes it even easier. Yeah, I think Kane on the solo is going to be my way of affording. I, I want to get like a Shadow Assassin chest plate. Fair and there is yeah. no way I'm affording that. <laughs> with, yeah, yeah, true, yeah. Uh, just dungeons grinding nowadays. Oh, yeah. And, and, and would you would you, would you you place minions for that? Like, would you ab like abuse? Okay. Abuse the fact that you can get so <laughs> much EXP from minions as well? Uh, EXP or coins? Yeah. No, no, EXP, uh, EXP. Right now, my minions on my main profile, the solo, is all snow minions. Mm -hmm. I uh, I I hate mining. Fair enough. And the fact that that's the best way to get mining XP is great. It's getting me to a bunch of level 100 pets, um, and it makes so much money. And especially during derpy, I mean, I'll probably be making like 3.3 million plus yeah, a yeah. day selling to the NPC just from snow minions. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I mean, yeah. Snow minions crazy. are insane. And and have you ever tried like mining in, in like the national mining event? It might, I mean, completely different skill, but that. Oh like, yeah, I I suffered through the second one. Both five hour sessions. I got like sixty eight million coins worth of refined mineral. Yeah, it's crazy. Like it's totally busted how much money you can make. It was I like also, a summoning yeah. eye every three minutes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is what it felt like. Totally, and the fact that you can forge, have a fortune on it is pretty, I don't know, it's pretty crazy. All right, wait, wait. we oh, have yeah, still like, good. we have three categories um, that I want you to rate it from like one to five stars, five being the best, one being the worst, uh, and starting yeah. off with difficulty. Like, this includes like other skills that you have gotten to, to like a higher skill, like, or have you grinded in a little bit more? How difficult would you say farming? And I would say at least right now, is it? In comparison to others so one to five one being the worst yeah uh, or wait do you want me to rank all the skills or do you want me to just give a rating to each one no no only a rating um, to farming compared to others like how difficult is farming compared to I don't know alchemy oh. or, or fishing um, I would say I mean the easiest skill would definitely be alchemy yeah. The second easiest would be mining because minions. So that would place farming at number three, in my opinion. Fair enough. Okay. So probably in terms of ease. a ton of stars, four, five. Probably um, I mean, it's pretty mindless, especially like even back when there was no builder's wand, there was no basket of seeds or yeah. special hoes or anything like four layers of pumpkin. Like you could just turn off your brain and watch movies as it happens, and like Fair you know, enough, yeah. the hours fly by pretty quick. I mean, I, <laughs> I can never see myself doing fishing. I mean, like, yeah. Whenever I talked to to menacing, he said he 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 listened to like the same song for like hours on hours, like just grind. Like he did <laughs> he did foraging, but he listened to the same song <laughs> for hours upon hours, and I was like, bro, you have to you have to go like completely <laughs> crazy. That sounds like a psychopath. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> yeah, totally. Oh no. Oh my god. Okay, next up we got joy. Like, how enjoyable is it? As 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 you can for like just like you said already, you can watch movies, you can do other stuff. I, I guess it's pretty enjoyable. Uh, from the farming itself, I derive no joy. Uh, <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, <laughs> if okay, I ever yeah. did it on stream. It would basically be like, if I was farming on stream, it would become a podcast. The yeah. gameplay in the background was just for the sake of progression, and I would just be interacting with chat. So it's like a whole lot of nothing. Yeah, if, like, I, I can't you, say okay. it's 
not enjoyable but it's not enjoyable it's just kind of like it's you know you don't even think about it okay i i see i see it's basically just like you want to get it off like you get you want to get like through it but you want to get through it with like as much other stuff done in the like on the side that you can do as well i guess okay, yeah, i would say enough. the most if i had to go one way i'd say it's a little frustrating because you don't have access to your hands like True. it would be nice to be able to type up a google doc instead of talking to my phone but you know i mean like... the fact that you did that is is pretty amazing like i actually have to admit i thought about something doing like like something around like this as well but i, I was like is google what was it actually good enough to 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 catch all the words and what what if you said something wrong like how did you delete it or whatever how did that work yeah out? i use a i use a pixel 3 it actually caught pretty much everything i said exactly i mean it struggled with a few terminologies in skyblock like yeah, it skyblock, doesn't know yeah. what it doesn't know how to pronounce prot <laughs> like, okay you know, fair enough <laughs> but you know for the most part like it understands okay I see and lastly we got time um how how long did it take compared to other skills it's like for you probably way longer than it should have like especially nowadays yeah yeah i mean most of my farming and if i look in my collection right now i'm in game it's like <laughs> let me see pumpkin 18.5 million almost <laughs> in the cow. top 100 <laughs> holy cow um <laughs> Wow. Most, you have like I would say at least 12 million of that was before pets, before XP boost potions. That was it must uh, hurt so like um I I feel sorry for you <laughs> even though I wasn't even the one grinding. Holy moly, wow. The cookie, and nowadays yeah. there's the pumpkin dicer the and cookie buff, the new turbo yeah. pumpkin cookie it's buff. Okay. How much it, do you know how much it, time yeah. you spend like hour wise? <sighs> All I know is three to five hours a day. I, for, when did I? The solo profile started in, I think, October of 2019. And like the farming started probably within two weeks of starting the profile, maybe a month. So I mean, a at month, an absolute every day, minimum, like it was like, holy cow. It had to have been at least three months of pretty much like five hours a day <laughs> if i had to guess so just like just the sound of this like it sounds like we talked about psychopaths like earlier before it sounds like <laughs> oh what did you do yeah i i clicked that button like for five hours a day for like literally three uh, three months did nothing else if i had to put a safe bet before <laughs> before even the combat xp or not even combat farming xp boost in the pets i would say i put yeah. in at least 400 hours of farming oh. if i had to put a number on it oh my god like I, I would have loved to have like some kind of um actual like time like for example i don't know if you have steam but steam has like the hours played you'd be on like yeah so hot so oh, skyblock has insane. that it's slash playtime i mean yeah but there's a lot of afking and whatnot in there right oh yeah, I didn't, I didn't AFK too much. I mean, I would say, mm, I would say about 20% of my playtime in that estimate is AFK. And it was like 2,500 hours, I think, so far <laughs> on that one profile. Wow. Wow. And I mean, I, I the I, hardcore I think... profile, like, wow. I, the hardcore has like 500 hours and I know I haven't AFK'd on that profile, like at all. So it's, it's... <laughs> Lastly, I just wanted to mention uh, or ask basically out of personal interest you had a, you had a job back then and you you managed to do that whilst having a job. I think that that must be an insane motivation for everyone else who's like, oh no, I have school and whatnot. I, I need to do something else. Yeah, like when Skyblock blew up, like it was around the same time I took a, uh, a website development job. It mm -hmm. was like nine to five. I had to ride my bike to get there, which was an hour wow each way <laughs> wait so, what wait what <laughs> was there I no have a car public and transport? i was like five hours away from home there was there was public transit but it was so far away that i had to bike to it was a train i had to bike to the train <sighs> station and then take the train to my job and then you know do that in reverse on the way back and dude it's <laughs> like this is what the what we're opening parts here what the hell dude so it was like 10 hours between commute plus work i'd get back and then i would probably stream for an average of three to five hours and anytime Just i 
like i would wake up early sometimes and get an hour of farming in before i went to work oh <laughs> so, not even on stream so i can get just not even on stream. <laughs> just wakes up thinks about pumpkins I, yeah i can't really call anybody a psychopath wow. to be honest <laughs> i mean yeah i respect the grind i guess <laughs> this is oh my god have that you had pumpkin pie anymore, though pumpkin pie oh it's yeah. delicious i think yeah it, yeah it, yeah definitely like whenever i come to america i'll, I'll have to hand deliver you a pumpkin pie for that effort <laughs> <laughs> that sounds amazing okay i mean well thank you so much for sharing that information and that experience i mean it's hard to feel i, I it's hard to feel in that experience especially being like i i think i'm, I'm farming level 30 so i can't imagine what i have to go through to get there i mean nowadays it's easier <laughs> right but oh yeah nowadays it's so much easier yeah i mean thank you so much for joining uh for everyone who hasn't seen his channel and i mean yeah if you if you haven't then you have probably been missing out on skyblock totally on youtube uh it's linked down in the description <laughs> <laughs> once again thank you so much for joining and i'll guess i'll see you on the next one goodbye thank you man it's been fun bye